Hi everyone, welcome to our eSpin training. My name is Nikhil and this is eSpin Ready 7 App Spider Technical Overview. App Spider from Ready 7, what is it actually? It is the web application security scanner in the modern world. Uh, it discovered holes, security holes in your application. Actually, it is dynamic, dynamically scanning applications for vulnerability across all modern technologies. Provides tools for remediation and monitors your applications for changes. Know your weak points. And the topic of our slide next is close the coverage gap with universal translation. Coverage is the first step to scan an evidence. Scanners were originally built with a crawl and attack architecture. But crawling doesn't work for web services and other dynamic technologies. App Spider goes beyond testing traditional name value prayer formats in HTML. It is universal translator. Interprets newer technologies used in web and mobile applications as Ajax, GRBT, REST, JSON, and the rest. App Spider provides broad coverage needed for today's wide variety of web applications. We continue to talk about our uh, App Spider and know your big points. And the next topic is uh, tech with ed intelligence. A spider doesn't test application mobility because we know today's applications are custom with unique size structure, parameters, names, and responses. It creates custom attacks based on your architecture to give you the most accurate results. To more currently simu simulate real world attacks, a spider conducts uh, positioning and proximity form analysis to intelligent input the data that the form is expected. Continuously monitor your application. Don't let you uh, don't let unknown risk keep you up a track. Expires continuous site monitoring identifies change in your application ecosystem that inevitably inject new vulnerabilities. It then triggers a rescan according to configurable settings. We continue and our next topic is conduct deep analysis. It's all about prioritize what matters most. Shifting through pages and pages of application vulnerabilities in a PDF report takes you takes too much time. Expire provides interactive actionable reports that behave like web pages with great organization and links for deep analysis. Analysis is easy because findings and organized and consolidated by attack types, accesses, SQL, and the others. And with one click, you can drill deep into vulnerability to get more information. Expires, sophisticated reports, reduce remediation time, and streamline communication with developers. Quickly replay web attacks. When reviewing a vulnerability report, it helps to be able to reproduce vulnerability to confirm that they are exploitable or to demonstrate the vulnerability to others. Apps part at the replay feature allows you to re reproduce individual attacks in real time with one, just one click and control application security programs. In order to improve 
your overall security posture you need, a high level view of your application security program that enables you to see where things stand and if they are improving. Expire provides centralized control and reporting over all aspects of your programs, including scan configuration, scheduling, and monitoring. Through the easy to use list of scans configured in the system, you can see and manage the entire list of completed scans set by scan configuration, start time, finish time, or configuration name. File checks for Apache Struts, two framework checks, Apache Struts detection, editing file, upload, autocomplete attribute. Blink SQL, brute force from out, brute force HTTP out, business logic abuse attacks, cookie attributes, credential stores in clear text in a cookie, cross site request for easy, cross site scripting, directory mixing, email disclosure, force and browsing, form session change, HTTP response scripting, HTTP speed transfer security, HTTPS. Downgrade, information disclosure, information leakage, Java Vinyl OS commanding, parameter infusing, profanity reflection, remote file including reverse proxy, secure and non secure context mix, server configuration, session fixation, session strange, source code disclosure, SQL injection, SQL injection out of bypass, SSL strange, unvalidated data URL. Rewriting web beacon, web service parameter fusing, X frame option missing HTTP refresh, and XXSS protection missing HTTP header, C custom created attack. Current enterprise requirements. Several hardware requirements. 4 GB of random access memory, 1 network interface, and 500 GB of hard bad space. Software required for server software. One of the following operating system: Microsoft Windows Server 2003 or 2003 R2, Microsoft Windows Server 2000 Service Pack 1, 32-bit or 64-bit, Microsoft Windows Server 2008 Edition, 32 or 64-bit, Microsoft Windows Server 2008 R2 Edition, 32 and 64B, Microsoft Windows Server 2012, 64B. A web application server with the following components, Microsoft ISP.NET, Pages Microsoft Internet Information Services, IIS 6.0, or later with the following ISP.NET pages, common files, simple main transfer protocol, as SMFTP services, worldwide web service, service database. One of the following versions of Microsoft SQL Server Microsoft SQL Server 2008 family including Express Edition Additional requirements Microsoft ISP.NET Pages Microsoft Internet Information Services as IS 6.0 All related is the following It is recommended to create an SQL Server account to be used by a Spider Enterprise It is recommended Install M Microsoft SQL Server Management Studio to avoid Internet Explorer 11 authentication issues. .NET 4.5 should be installed on a web server box. To successfully install expired enterprise, you must have installed IS 6.0 management capability on your IS 7.0 machine. For more information, including instruction for installing IS 6.0 management capability, please see the website of Expired on Register. Please. Thanks for joining us. It was technical overview of Rapid 7 Expired by ESPIN. If you have any inquiries, please contact us or just visit our website www.e-spincorp.com. Thank you so much.